Hello everyone, I'm Erica Xu from Model 3D EMEA support team. So today we're going to um, show you some tips and tricks to work around pre-process and post-process to make your time with Model 3D more convenient and uh, easier. Today's uh, tips and tricks will be divided into four parts. First, we'll cover some uh, tips that you can use to work around with a studio interface, including uh, some hotkeys and key combinations, mouse control to make your work easier. Um, next, we'll cover uh, some tips while creating geometry and uh, fixing your mesh. Then we will we'll talk about some tips in constructing uh, your runner closing to your, real, uh, your design in reality. Then we will, we will show you some tips in doing post processing and some tips in the problem points and how to show um, the result in the desired way. First, like to, uh, let's look at some tips in the working with Studio Interface. In Studio, we will work with Model Tree a lot. The model tree uh, is located in the left part of uh, in the interface, and uh, all your objects will be grouped with different attributes. And one of the uh, in convenient function is uh, hover to highlight. When you hover your mouse on the object uh, uh, in model tree, the part that is hovered would be highlighted with this yellowish uh, orange color. So take this for example, there are two parts in the model and when you hover on the first part and the part will be highlighted and when you hover on the other, the other would be highlighted. So when you want to uh, find the one that you want to choose, you can use these tricks to, um, to look for the right one. And when will be when will this function be useful? For example, when you have uh, many uh, cooling channel groups in your model, and then you want to redesign one of them, then how do you find the right one to delete and redesign? 